if they have a student who is creative but maybe is feeling or they're sensing that there's that um, I don't know, holding back on, on their part, a kind of self-enforced um, holding back, what, what advice would you give to educators to help that child feel less guilty about their creative insights? I mean, it's a, it's a difficult situation to, to be in. I, I imagine a lot of teenagers actually don't feel like there's anything that they can do to pursue their passions more, you know. I mean, one, one of the things about being a teenager is you really don't have full agency over your life. So you're very constricted, it seems, you know, it feels by all of the adults around you. Um, but look, to, to educators, I would say, um, I actually just think noticing and commenting and complimenting can mean a massive, massive deal. Like I did not get much attention from English teachers at high school. No one noticed that I could write, that I was interested in books and writing. I really received no creative encouragement from anyone except for one teacher. And I'll always remember this teacher. And she took note of a short story that I'd written. You know, we would get to write creatively so little in English. There'd be like one or two pieces a year where we were cut loose to do, you know, a creative piece. And it would be the best, you know, the best time for me. I would love it. Um, and so I'd written a, a short story and my English teacher noticed, you know, and she said, I think this is really good and I'd like to enter it into a competition. And I, did, I didn't get anywhere in the competition, but actually that didn't matter. What mattered was is that my teacher noticed me, that she noticed something I did. And she said, you know what, that's great what you did. I, I've seen you and I've noticed you. I, I think you've got something there. Um, and it was just one comment for the whole six years of high school. And I obviously remember it very clearly and held on to that comment for many, many years. So I, I would say to educators, you know, you might not feel like you could do much, but you can at least let the student know that you've seen them. You know, you've seen their passion, their creativity, their imagination, and you appreciate it. 